welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here to share with you guys something new that Her Given Hair is offering. They are now offering U-Part units on their site. Starting November 21st, you'll be able to purchase U-Parts. I've been asked so many times if I can actually make units for different people. Well, now you don't need me. You can actually go and purchase your own. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can actually go about installing the U-Part. I received the Coily Texture U-Part. And I'm going to show you guys what it looks like coming right off the packaging. It comes in this really nice box. What I love about Hergen Hair is their packaging is always so amazing. Generally, their packaging comes in a black box, but the U-Part units comes in this vanilla color, which is really cute. And I'm actually going to use this as one of my decorative pieces in my place after I take my unit out and begin the installation process. I love So this is what the curls look like. They look really pretty right out of the packaging, but I wouldn't advise anybody to just wear curly hair, especially kinky curly hair, just right out of the packaging, because for me, it doesn't look as natural. If you want it to look as natural as possible, you need to actually go about the process of co-washing the hair, which I will be demonstrating in a moment. This unit has a very small leave out, which is ideal for most naturals, because the goal of wearing a protective style or a unit is to actually protect our hair, and you want to protect as much as possible so having the majority of your hair covered is essential. On the inside there are combs, and they've included combs here, near where the leave out will be, as well as around the parameter of the, the unit. And there are one, two, three, four. There are five combs total, and there's also an elastic band, so that if it's not fitting your head the way you like, you're able to adjust it. So, and I'm kind of wondering if I were to I turn it around to the back, could I maybe do the flip over method? I'd like to explore that, so we'll see what happens. Before actually purchasing one of the U-parts, you want to make sure that you measure your head. So I have a measuring tape here to show you all how I went about that process. The first size option is on the smaller end, which is pretty much probably the average size for someone's head. And then you have my size, which is quite large. <laughs> So size option one is the circumference is 21.5 to 22 inches. The front to nape is 14 inches. Ear to ear across the forehead is 12 inches. And then size two, the options are 22.5 to 23 inches. And front to nape is 14.5 inches. And then ear to ear across the forehead is 13 inches. So now I'm gonna go about actually washing this hair. So. Keep watching. For the whole unit, this is all the shedding that I experienced, which is really good. I've had more shedding than this for one bundle of hair, so for a whole unit, this is phenomenal. So I'm going to begin prepping my leave out. I usually like to have my hair with a side part, so I'm going to leave this side part. I'll clean it up later and actually make my hair look less interesting to say the least because it's a little it's a little dry currently. It also has some gel that's been exposed from when I laid down my edges previously, but I'm gonna fix all that. So
product review on this product in my last video and I'll link that video here or here one or the other wherever you see the eye just click on that eye and you'll be able to have access to that video If you're wanting a full unit instead of a U-part unit, this one is actually interchangeable. So you could actually use it at the U-part by cutting the lining here, or you could flip it over, just turn it over to the back and put it on your head, and it becomes a full unit. So you just insert the combs, You could just change this one and it looks so fabulous. I'm 
just going in any areas that don't have as much definition as I like. I'm just applying more of the glaze and the curl maker. Once again, I've shared in the past, my hair type can blend with all of the textures. And if I can get my hair type to blend with all the textures, then many of you all should be able to do the same using the technique that I showed you guys. If you apply the curl defining um, the curl defining glaze as well as gel and slip down, slip down your edges and do maybe a wash and go for some textures that will work for you. And for others, you may want to do a flat twist out or even a twist out for others but for me I was able to blend my hair with this texture so simply by using the all natural curl defining glaze as well as eco styler I just use those products and my hair blends very well with this hair it looks very natural to blend my hair I use the finger combing technique so I'm simply just Finger combing my hair in with the extensions. Another technique is actually taking strands of my hair. Where is my hair? I can't even find it. And just place it under the hair. I'm gonna add some more gel. So I'm just gonna place it, I'm just gonna tuck it under the hair. I love the shape of the hair when it dries. It kind of has the heart shape. It actually looks like I may have cut it, but I actually didn't. So I love this U part. Her getting hair did an amazing job. I love how it's constructed. I love where they placed the combs and then that they added elastic bands. Those were actually my saving grace because I did request a larger size than is actually um, the size of my head. You want to make sure you actually measure your head and you go for the actual measurements that are on their site. I kind of um, went for a larger size because I felt like maybe the, the smaller size might not fit my head because I generally consider my head to be a large head, but I should have gone for size one. So just measure your head as I showed at the beginning of this video so that you can make sure you have the perfect size cap. If you do not order the perfect size cap, you can always bobby pin, which is what I'm going to do. So it's not a lost cause. It is a little larger, but I love it. It looks so natural. So I'll see you ladies in my next video. I will link all of my Her Given Hair videos here. So if you click on the eye, it's going to be here or here. I'm not sure where the eye is going to show up. But if you click on the eye, all of my Her Given Hair tutorials, you will see all of those. I'll be styling this hair in an upcoming video. I will also be showing you guys how to install the kinky extensions and also how I style those. So look out for those videos. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure you thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Share this video with a friend as well, guys. I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Bye.